Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to be filming a spring break haul today and I'm even more excited because my spring break officially starts tomorrow. So it's currently Friday morning and I'm heading out on Saturday morning to go to Cancun, Mexico with some of my friends and I am seriously so excited. I've never been to any kind of tropical resort before and so I am so looking forward to this trip and of course I had to do a little bit of shopping to prepare. So I want to start by showing you guys some stuff that I got from the Impeccable Pig and this is a boutique and they have them all across the southeast um, they have one here in Nashville but they also have an online website so if you want to shop online I'll put links to everything that I'm showing down below because it's all really really cute just a warning that their stuff is a little bit more pricey but everything in the store I, I literally wanted to buy everything it was all exactly my style and I loved every single thing that they had. So the first thing I have here is this little gingham top and it's a spaghetti strap top but look at all these cute fun ruffles on it. It's kind of wrinkly right now. I need to iron it but I think this is so cute and it'll be great for the hot weather down there. Now we have another gingham top except this is like a light blue gingham and look at all the pretty embroidery on it. I just love it and it also has this cute little lace detailing and then the bottom is kind of like a little flare like it's peplum style and I think the shirt is so cute they had so many embroidered items in their store and I wanted to buy all of them and this one I, I had to narrow it down and this one was the cutest one that I ended up with <laughs> and I think this is the last top I got from the impeccable pig but it's another embroidered top as you can tell I love embroidery I love bright colors hence what I'm wearing but this one is kind of like a different fabric like it's a little bit it's not like super soft, but I still really like it. And um, it's short sleeve. It has a little cutout on the sleeve, so that's really fun. And it's just embroidered on the front. The back is just white but love this I think it's gonna look great in Mexico I also got three dresses from the impeccable peg here is the first one again another embroidered item but I just love the look of this so this one is like a pretty light blue and it has some really fun ruffly sleeves this dress is like slightly short on me just a little bit but I didn't think it was short enough not to buy it so I decided to get it anyways because I just loved the colors on it all right and this dress looks pretty similar to the top that I showed you guys a minute ago but it is a a light blue seersucker dress and as you can see it also has some really pretty embroidery on it and then it has this one little like white strip of lace right there and I do think this will be great for Mexico but I also think I could wear this on Easter because I love seersucker for Easter and so I thought this would be a good dress for that and it has pockets so that makes it even better okay y'all and this last dress is not gonna be everyone's cup of tea but I really liked it my mom really liked it the um, salesperson in the store my friend Rachel she really liked it and so I decided to get it but here it is it is an off-the-shoulder again another like gingham checkered print but this is a black and it's just a pretty simple dress down on the bottom but then you see the top and you're like whoa and so as you can see it has some like rainbow multicolored pom-poms on it and it has this cute little zigzag stitching across the top and I just thought that this was really unique really different the girl in the store was like yeah we've never had anything like this before you should buy it because it's something totally unique that no one else is gonna have so I went for it I got it and I think this will be perfect in Mexico and I also think I could wear this even when I'm not in Mexico back in Nashville too alright and that's everything from the impeccable pig again I will put a link down below to their store if you want to check out any of those items and now I have a couple of things from Target to show you guys so I went to Target looking for a bathing suit or just like a couple of new swimsuit tops and I couldn't really find anything I did pick up one and I got this top right here it's not really my favorite I haven't taken the tag off yet because I think I might return it like depending on if I need to wear it while I'm down there or not Target just did not have the greatest selection and some of them I thought were cute but then they fit really weird and so I just didn't have a ton of luck in the swimsuit department there but I did get this top I'm not sure again if I'm gonna keep this I'll keep you guys updated if I do. But I did find a super cute cover-up. My mom actually saw this in Target and pointed it out to me and I was like, mom, you know me, that's perfect. So it's this just pretty plain little baby doll dress except on the bottom it has some fun pink pom-poms. Like you guys knew it wasn't just gonna be plain, right? You knew there had to be something coming down here. Of course there are pink pom-poms. And then there are some cute ties like on the side with little pink tassels. Again, another cute touch. And uh, my friend Rachel, who we're going to Mexico with, was telling us that you're not really supposed to eat in the restaurant unless you have a cover-up on. And so I was like, well, now I have a new cover-up. 
this will be perfect. And then while I was at Target, of course I did some other shopping too, not exactly for spring break, but they always have cute stuff there and I just couldn't help myself. So I got this really cute little denim shirt right here and I love denim shirts because you can dress them up, make them a little fancier or dress them down. They can be more casual. And I liked how this one was sleeveless and then it has a little ruffle on the edge right here. And again, this is pretty plain, but I think it'll be a great wardrobe staple. And it was only $25, so that's a good deal. Lastly from Target, again, don't know if I'm going to bring these on spring break with me or not, but I saw these pink shorts right here and I just had to pick them up because I don't have any shorts in this color. And you guys probably know this color is like super in right now and I don't really own any clothes in this color. Actually, I think I have a top that's this color, but I thought it would be fun to have some shorts in this fun like millennial pink color. So I picked these up and they're really, really comfortable. They're not too short and I'm a big fan of them. And lastly, I just have a couple things to show you guys from this other boutique in Franklin, which is like right outside of Nashville if you are unfamiliar with that. But I actually know the owner of this store and I went and did a little like blogger collaboration with them. Uh, I guess that was like two weeks ago. I did that for Valentine's Day and it was super fun. And so while I was there, I picked out some stuff. So I'm going to put a link to their website down below. They don't have everything listed online, but hopefully some of this will be available and you guys can shop. If not, I'll put links to like similar stuff down there. So if if you follow me on Instagram, you would have already seen this top right here, which I think is so cute. It's black and I don't wear a lot of black. It's clearly like washing me out right now. But it has, again, some really fun embroidery on it. I mean, guys, do I like embroidery or not? But I really like this shirt. It's so unique and the sleeves also have this fun ruffle on them and there are some little tassel ties. So I mean, really everything about this shirt. I love it. It's super comfy. Again, don't think I'll bring this on spring break because it'd probably be a little bit hot with the long sleeves, but it's a great transition piece for going into spring. Next thing I got are a little out of my comfort zone that I would never have seen myself wearing, but I just decided to pick them up while I was there. And they are these like moto jeggings. And I just got a white pair. Um, which will be good for the spring, summer, later on in the warmer months. They're really fun because they have this like, um, what would you even call this? I don't know. They have these little stripes kind of and they're kind of edgy. They even have a zipper on the bottom, which is cool, I guess. But I just decided to go out of my comfort zone a little bit and get something new and try out these moto leggings. And I wore them once the other day because I really needed to wear like some white pants with something. And so... I, I liked them then, so I'm excited to keep wearing them. And I actually got two other tops, but one of them uh, I can't find right now because my room is really messy, and so I think it's like down in the bottom of my laundry basket, which is sad. But I got a really cute black shirt, but the other last thing I technically got was this sweater right here, which I think is really, really fun. As you can see, it has the like crisscross detailing and like the little... Um, tie going down the front which I like and this is so comfortable it's not like super super thick it's kind of like that waffle knit material if you know what I'm talking about and so this has also been a great transition piece for going into the spring because some days it's warm here some days it's cold so I have been wearing this and I really like it. Alright guys, and that was everything I had to show you in this spring break haul. I really hope you liked this video. If you did enjoy it, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and I would also appreciate if you could subscribe down below. Also, you're going to want to subscribe if you want to stay up to date with my trip to Mexico because I think I'm going to vlog it and so stay updated for a vlog coming soon. Also, another way you can stay up to date with me on my trip is by following me on Instagram. So be sure to follow me. I'll have the link to that down below as well. Hope you guys like this video. Again, I love you all so much. Thank you guys for watching and I will talk to you next time. Bye!